good morning <laughs> um yeah so we're going to just start sporadically working on some projects and see where we're going there um i want to make a granny square sweater vest um with these colors that i got that was supposed to be for something else and then it didn't work out basically but it's these, this, this, and this, I think. I think. Hold on. Actually, what am I doing? I'm not holding this. I'm going to this on this. Yeah. And this one. Well, this was supposed to be a sweater vest in a different way but i don't want to make slip stitches anymore <laughs> but now looking at it i don't think i have enough yarn maybe i don't know how i want the square to be so yeah Ooh, but i also have this green i really like this green but i like these two colors Ooh, would it work with all three of these wow me trying to put green in everything as i should it's my right oh wait what about this wait 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 what if i do oh wait what if i do these four i like this wait what's gonna be on the outside okay i'm gonna take <laughs> I'm going to take all of these with me. I'm going to watch Bridgerton with my friend today. And I want to have to something to do with my hands. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take all of these with me and see which ones that I want to do. And then we'll work from there. Actually, no, that's for my sweater project. But I like that green that's in there. I'm actually low-key driving myself crazy. I don't even have... I don't think I have extra. We'll figure something out. But overall, granny square. I'm gonna get my bag together and then I gotta skedaddle because I'm supposed to be in my friend's place after one ish. Not after one, after 11. And it's almost two o'clock. So this is the three options that I kind of came up with. Um. Now looking at this in a better light, I actually don't like this. <laughs> so this one's not an option anymore. <laughs> um, so I'm, I'm looking at these two. I like this, right? And But I really like this too. And so basically it's like with or without this. Now I said before that I was going to use this color on its own for a sweater vest. But then I decided I wanted to do a granny one. And now, I don't know, now looking at it on camera, looking at it stuff on camera versus looking at it in person is kind of two different things. Because in person, I feel like I like this more. Um, it's not as, and it could just be my camera and the lighting, it's not as saturated as it is here. And, but this one's like a lighter feel. And I like, I don't know, I like them both, to be honest. I like them both, but I can't put them like, I mean, I can put them together, but I can't put them together. I also have to make sure that I can just do the four colors and not have to do the five. Because if I have to do five, then for this one, I was going to, like, you know, repeat it. So this would be on the outside. And so this will look even lighter. And then this, I'll probably maybe have this on the outside. I don't know. I would have to check see which one that I like. But I'm leaning towards this, but but only on camera. Off camera, I like this. I might make them both, if maybe if I have the funds. I don't know. I also have to, again, check because with the pattern that I'm using, they use five colors, but I'm using a bigger needle, and I'm hoping that using the bigger needle, I can just use the four to cover my voluptuous self. <laughs> so let's see how that works. Um, I'm also going to play games. 
I have my headphones on because, you know, I'm gaming. Also, I'm using my mug. I actually really, really love this. Um, it's just an energy drink in here, though. Because <laughs> I need the energy. Um, even though it's Sunday, I should be chillaxing. No, Mike. Doing this real quick before I go to bed. Um, so, you did on doing this one for this sweater vest. Um, like that. And then I have to do, I think, like, oop, come on, there we go. And then have to do some that are like this. So, yeah, we decided on these colors. Um, I wanted to also make a green themed one too, but I'm just not liking the colors. Like, and I've done different, as you can see, the different combinations. Um, and I'm just not liking it. And wow, it even looks worse on camera but it could be because i'm tired and i'm just not liking them anymore um i don't want to do it anymore so yeah um i thought this was going to be it and this is not it um and i'm trying not to make it look like because i have like these gloves that are like these colors i think i use these colors except this is a darker green than i use on my gloves um and I didn't want it to look like that because then I would have to get more of this. And I have a lot of this yarn, so I low-key kind of want this dark green yarn to be on the outside. But I'm just not, I'm just not liking the colors. Maybe if I put that in place of this light green. Or is that, maybe, I don't know. So, I'll think on that. I'll sleep on it, but this is... This is a definite yes. Also, one of the people in the Discord that I'm in said that this one kind of makes it look like pie. And now I just want to keep it, except for I'll probably change this out for this. So it look a little bit more like pie and this will look like a little dollop of whipped cream. So I might do that, but for now, we're just gonna do the other one. Okay. So, before I forget, because I feel like I'm going to forget, I have, <laughs> I think I spent like 10 minutes trying to choose which colors I want. So now, it's definitely these. This one's going to be one, and this one's going to be the other. So I am making two. I just, I want these colors more in my wardrobe. So, I'm making this, and I'm making this. And I'm, hopefully, I have enough. Um... If not, we'll see. Because I usually like to overbuy for projects so I don't have to worry about matching the dye lot, you know? If you know, you know. But yeah, look how pretty I am. I found another video today, so you should see that one before you see this one, but who knows? I'm very sporadic because that was originally going to be the background and then it don't work out. So. Hello, as I talk to you from this angle because I am very upset. <laughs> and I'm just giving a little update before hopefully I don't scrap this project out of anger. I'm not, but I'm going to have to go to the store again tomorrow to return the yarn that I bought that I can't use because I ran out of the outside yarn, right? For the second one. But the yarn that I got doesn't match even it's the same yarn it's the same brand it doesn't match it it's like a different texture i've had different colors before because you know dye lots but a different texture is a whole nother thing now i don't know what to do for the outside of this <laughs> um i'm all around upset Today was just not a good day in general. I just wasn't feeling it. And then stuff kept on piling on top of it. And it's just like, why do anything anymore? But I don't want to think like that. So I don't know what to do yet because that outside color is supposed to be like the ribbing and whatnot. And now I can't do that. So I might just make the brown one and be done, but I really want I really wanted a green one. Now that's not possible. Yeah. 
Yeah, I'm about to go to bed. Bear with me. I was just outside and it was hot. Um, okay, so we decided not to take the yarn back. Um, what we're doing is we're going to do a different size. So I'm going to have an extra large and a large and hope for the best. Which I'll be really sad if the green one doesn't fit because, you know, green is my favorite color. And I want to have more green things in my wardrobe. So here's the large. I am starting to sew them up. See, on camera, they have, they have a green look that's like a little bit lighter, but it's not like a lot. But I was able to use the scraps to make the smaller one because the large, they have smaller squares. It's like one less row. And then I have the other one. Please excuse my pile of laundry in the back there. But yeah, um, we're going to do that while we watch National Treasure. <laughs> Because I feel like life is getting a bit out of control. And you know what I don't have to do in my life? Steal the Declaration of Independence. Now that's stressful. <laughs> At this angle, that means you run into another problem. So I tried it on. I kind of tried it on. I kind of wanted to see what it looked like around my chest. It doesn't fit. Here's the thing. I don't know. <laughs> I'm going to put the. I'm gonna like put it together. Here's my thing, and I feel like I knew this might be a problem. Is because I tried to do it with one less row, but with a bigger needle, and I thought that would make it bigger. Apparently not. And so I'll probably have to make the other ones bigger or like put another square on it or another two squares because I think putting two more squares will fix it. But at the same time, we thought you were so close to the end and you happen not to be. And it's just like... How much would this have... I don't think it will affect it too much. Or maybe... My thing is, this yarn isn't like the same color. Which is why I had to make it smaller for the first place for this other one. Like, the other one's going to be fine for me to make it bigger. For, for this one... I want to go to bed. And I think that's what's going to happen. Yeah. That's, that's what I'm feeling. Yeah. Okay. For this, I had to add another panel because I am a big girl. I'm also wearing a hoodie, which is probably not the best for me. Okay. Hey, look at that. It fits. I'm glad I had the panel because it wasn't fitting before. Can you tell that this last one is different? than the others probably but yeah look at that now i just gotta do the ribbing stuff i did not i don't think i have any footage of me sewing this together but um this one i did the matcher stitch this one i kind of did like an overlock stitch which honestly i like how that looks better and i wish i did that for this also i think it kept the size better with the mattress stitch you like pull it together and i don't know i think it like took away some spots oh see look there's like a hole here there's like holes in some spots that aren't like the corner mm, i probably have to like go through it but at the same time it might be better after like keep it this looks so tight on me <laughs> uh, it's basically like a crop top because it's like my belly button's here so it's like right here but this will also probably look better with the right shirt. So let's put the other one on. This is also... This one's also a little snug. Oh wait, I forgot about my hood. That's probably what's stuck on. Oh yeah, I am definitely the extra large. <laughs> this is so much nicer. I'm not wearing a bra though. 
and this is a little closer to my belly button <laughs> so less, less less cropped so like a proper sweater vest so yeah need to do this size but i was running out of yarn for that size which we've talked about before and me almost crying about i also was actually no i wasn't on my cycle i don't think i was that wouldn't matter i would have cried about it off my cycle um just looks so crazy but for the reveal i'll look really pretty yeah this is it this is how it's looking this feels really nice um i'm about to put on the other one in a second but um i know this one is gonna fit which is why i <laughs> which is why i'm doing the wrap-up in this outfit before i change into the other one but yeah this ended up not being as hard as i thought i didn't mind doing the granny squares the sewing it together took a little bit i just wish i didn't run out of yarn on the other one so they can be the same size but this ended up being way cuter and then i got like a bunch of these skirts after i went to like a dark academia event so <laughs> this ended up working out really really well <laughs> um so yeah i'll probably make more of these i'm gonna i've been learning more granny square patterns um so i'll probably have some different ones but man this color looks so great and then it looks so great on me oh and i look so pretty <laughs> but yeah thank you for watching i hope you had a good time going on the adventure of making this with me i hope you have a wonderful good day afternoon evening night and don't forget to like comment and subscribe share with your family friends and co-workers and i hope to see you soon